the shell. You want to take a look at it here again? Yeah. Beautiful. Here, look at it. Wow, that's really cool. The microphone lens is a stick-on lens that turns any cell phone or tablet into a portable digital microscope. Imagine like a contact lens for your phone camera. Cool. The magnification ranges from 15 times to 150 times. That's almost like a professional microscope. A normal optical microscope can cost anywhere from 200 bucks to 800 bucks. For that price, we can equip an entire classroom with microscopes. I started this project as a student at university, graduated and had no money. Um, I applied for grants, I applied for loans, nothing. So I had actually moved back in with my parents. Um, and in sort of a last ditch effort, I launched a Kickstarter and I asked for $5,000, hoping, you know, I didn't even think I would get that. Hit go, go to sleep, come back the next day, and there's like $10,000, hundreds of people backing it, and the numbers are just going up and up and up and up. And by the end of those three weeks, over 5,000 people around the world had pledged over $80,000. As the project grew, I started getting uh, emails from people all over the world. One of the first people who came to me to say, I need your help, was uh, Leah Marshall. So Leah works on water sanitation and it actually walked around the Amazon. You know, the beauty of it is instead of carrying a 20 pound microscope, now I have a microscope that's smaller than the tip of my thumb that I can put on my cell phone and that local people can put on their own cell phones, which a lot of them also have. Recently, I got an email from Basil Malakai. He's working on a medical startup. He wants to use the microscope to screen for common illnesses and bring healthcare to rural Tanzanians. I looked at it as a personal problem because I lost uh, a brother in 2008 of uh, sickle cell disease. The ratio, actually, for, for doctor to patient in Tanzania is 1 to 30,000. That's devastating. So at, at this moment, you know, malaria is our focus. We've got sickle cell, we've got leukemia. We went into the labs. We, they had a few uh, blood samples prepared for us. We used their microscopes to have a look on the sort of image those would give us. And then we compared it to the ones we got from the lens. And you know, they're quite excited about technology like that. And actually they don't believe it works because it's this tiny compared to the current uh, microscopes they have in the laboratory. Not until they see it working. So, you know, it gets rid of the bulky, uh, existing microscope, the expensive equipment, and the record-keeping techniques, the potential is, I mean, it's, it's over the roof, yeah. When I saw it, it was like, well, what if we could get one of these to every health promoter? What if we could get one to every school teacher? What if we could get one to every hospital and every clinic? And they're so small, they're so cheap, affordable, um, but I think could really revolutionize the way that we do uh, hygiene and sanitation. I always had big dreams for this project, but the more I talk to people and the more I see this impact people's lives, um, the more I realize you know, how, how big of a deal this can be to making the world a better place.